This is 2OF Entertainment. Welcome to Petrol Hedonism Underground, this Petrol Hedonism Live event here at Wembley. This is 13th and 14th of April 2024. This is the second time that they've done this incredible event right here in Northwest London. It's handy for me because I live a stone's throw from here, so that's quite good, isn't it? The doors opened about just over an hour or so ago. The crowd streamed in. It's already really busy. You can see over here, this is the Petrol Hedonism tent. Now, this is just one area. So this is the green zone. This is, by the way, that's Chiro, who's the organizer of Petalism. That's his Lamborghini right there. So this is only one area. This is the green zone. And then over there, a little short walk away across the road, there's another car park, the pink zone. And that has two levels, all packed with incredible cars. There's some amazing vehicles here, some fantastic people. Let's take a look around. Let's talk to a few people. Let's find out what this event is all about. Sebastian, uh, I am on the West London Classic as well today, yeah. but with different car <laughs> this with time. With a different car. I was really sorry to hear what happened to your car. Unfortunately, it was stolen. It was an E36, beautiful car. You, you saw, we saw in our video you were polishing it and cleaning it, yeah. but it got stolen unfortunately after that. Yeah, literally uh, one day, the same day when I came back from my holiday, it's stolen from my car park. And we managed to, to catch the people, but they crashed and car is written off and that was uh, that was new purchase as well, so it was yeah. really sad for me. That must be heart wrenching, yeah. really, really hard. But my wife, she just uh, told me that good is not the, this one, you know, yeah. at least, you know, it's... So this is this is your second wife, as you said. This said. is my second wife, this is my uh, <laughs> my dream car when yeah. I was a little, little boy, when I was 16 years old, grow up in Poland, when I saw this car, yeah. Literally all German cars because yeah. you know we, we pulled them from Poland. Yeah, we pulled yeah. the all German cars from Poland. So but when I saw specifically like the, the E36, yeah. I was just in love. In Poland I got black version of this, but I crashed. Oh, no. Then I purchased this like a car parts. Yeah. But then I choose to stay in UK. Yeah. I sold the black one. I started building red one. So this is like period of two cars, like 20 years. Yeah, right. So, so this is like low mileage, like 60,000. But that wasn't that nice. Like, like looks nice. So you restored this one? Yeah, it's not Pretty like much. full restoration, yeah. but uh, more modification. Yeah. But you know, it looks absolutely stunning. How are you enjoying this event? Yeah, I've been here last year. Still, I didn't, uh, I didn't, uh, yeah. I didn't walk around. Yeah. But it's like really busy. A lot of people, like 
Yeah, it's nice. West London. A lot of, a lot of people, like you said, a lot of people. <laughs> yeah. And we've had quite a few people walk across the camera, but you know, yeah. it's a busy show. That's yeah, what yeah, happened, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah, but yeah. anyway, it was so good to see you again, man. Yeah, good brown car guy. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I am with Helen Stanley, who is the artist that's painting the Lamborghini. Um, she was in talks with Chiro, who obviously runs Petrol Hedonism, and Mark McCann was shown his Lamborghini, and Helen just really wanted to be involved, and he offered to have the Lambo painted, which is amazing, because that's something that Helen's always wanted to do, is do live art on a car. It's very unusual, because normally you see like airbrushing and that sort of thing, but this is actually directly painting onto the car. Yeah, so it's covered in Expel PPF, right. um, so you can paint directly over it. She's using acrylic paint, so, right. um, it, so with the uh, PPF it can just be easily pulled off, obviously right. professionally, don't yeah. do it yourself. Yeah, yeah. Um, so it's going to cause no damage to the car or anything like that, and because she's using acrylics, you could put more PPF PPF over to protect it if you wanted yeah. to keep the, the design or because it's water based if it gets too wet it will run um, but yeah so uh, she's practiced it and it works so yeah so what's the theme here what what, what, what is that what are we going to see uh, so Helen's way of art is all pop art abstract bright right, colors right. things like that she's very inspired by Andy Warhol and he actually did an art car yeah. sort of in the 60s yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and I think that's where she's taken the inspiration from so it's all going to be very sort of cohesive with her branding yeah. um, uh, all her artwork that's available is all based around pop art and abstract art should be amazing I'm looking forward to seeing how it turns out so over the two days is how you're gonna do it right? yeah absolutely yeah. so she's doing it today she's yeah. gonna be um, sort of finishing the bonnet today and having some paint on the sides and then by tomorrow it's all just gonna be put together awesome. with all the finer details and everything like that so awesome. yeah. so much. Thanks no, for thank you Sam Stockman. And you have this incredible truck with 1939, 1947? Yeah. GMC Co, which we've covered in the past. Yeah. But to Petrol Hedonism Underground, this is your new toy? Yeah, I've had it 18 months. Oh, yeah, okay. 18 month old toy. Yeah. Uh, but you put what, how many miles on it? Um, well, we had a little problem because I bought it, uh, had it in my garage for about six months and went to drive it and then blew the engine up. Oh no! So six months never used it, and then another six months having the engine rebuilt. Oh my gosh! It's just the new um, the, the Ford engines suffer with no zinc. Right. And a lot of oils don't have zinc, so it causes so a problem. To... So tell us about the car. What is it? Uh, it's a DB 427 SC built by Dave Brooks. He builds them to absolute FIA um, original standard. Um, this one's been overboard because the engine had to be rebuilt. It's 7.5 litre. 7.5 litre. How much horsepower have we got? About 500. <laughs> heck of a beast, this thing, huh? Absolutely. <laughs> What's it like on the roads? Hard work, <laughs> but, but exhilarating. Exhilarating, yeah, yeah. I love the number plate. Explain the number plate. Well, it's just a 72 plate, but yeah. um, if, if you scroll through the number plates for sale, you can uh, you can find what you want. And, that's uh, extraordinary. So this my 7.2 litre AC. AC Cobra, that's what that is. Exactly, that's amazing. Yeah. That's yeah. absolutely brilliant. Yeah. So will we see this car in action this year? Yeah, of course. So we're looking forward to that. Well, I, I've almost finished running it in, so yeah. uh, it will be about.